All right, welcome back, guys. It's me, Chavi. We're reaching the end of this section of the white paper that where we're looking at the theory and all the uh, concepts to understand the value of the two token. In future chapters, we're going to be looking at the DAP, where we're going to be doing the practice. So leaving the theory and taking action and doing the practice. Very soon. Let me first, though, explain a little bit what the launchpad is and how valuable and powerful can this be in a long or short term. <clears throat> Sorry for that. So if we go to the launchpad, we're going to see that there's a list of projects, okay? Those projects are projects that have been launched by the help of Tutelus because Tutelus is uh, a partnership or because they all burn, uh, sorry, they all um, born from, from a formation made in Tutelus. So they're ex-students that have launched their own project. However, those have been uh, launched when the launchpad of the Tutelus, the official launchpad of the Tutelus was not released. So therefore, it's more than 10 projects and startups that have emerged. However, these ones have not really went through the launchpad official that we see in the DAP. Okay, we're going to look at that as well. However, this is going to be very powerful because it's going to give a lot of value to the TOOT token because people are going to have to have the TOOT token in order to participate to IDOs. But I think I'm just going too quick. Let's go step by step. So firstly here, introduce what a launchpad is. I, I'm sure many, uh, many of you heard that concept, but it... It's the platform where you can invest in IDOs, in initial DEX offering, in projects that are about to be listed in, in, in exchanges, the centralized exchange, uh, obviously, and have a lot of potential value. At the same time, they're also kind of risky. So we see here that three already liquid tokens have been achieved, and these have been the returns so far. To the all-time high, ATH, Fit Token has done a 3,700%. It's massively uh, Poem has done 1,150% and the Toot token has done a 700. So we did do a time six with the Toot token when it was released at the beginning. Now, if you want to know the difference between an IDO and all the ECOs that were very famous in 2017 and so on, I recommend you to have a look at this. What are the difference in an IDO and other models? Okay, so what is the difference in IDO with ECO? That is a very common one. Mainly to, to mention quickly, IDOs um, end up in, in sex, so they can end up in centralized exchange, but they're all started in a decentralized exchange. It's not exactly DEX, it's an AIM, but however, we understand each other. It is an automated market maker like SushiSwap, QuickSwap, PancakeSwap, all of these DEXs that have liquidity in terms of decentralization are the places where the IDOs are burned. So, uh, born, sorry, not burned, born. So it is very powerful because it is much more decentralized than an ECO and there's no chance for the others to, to steal the money if they do not have more than 51% of the tokens. Now, how is this going to work? This is going to work between a gamified and a tiered investment, which makes it really more cool. As I was saying previously, is despite... Well, so it does matter the amount of two uh, uh, tokens that you have and that you're holding, because if you're holding l more than 1,000 toots, you're just going to be considered a Tutelian. And the new IDOs that are going to be listed, you're going to be participating in them with 100% lottery of your allocation. So you're not going to know if 100 or 300 or $200 are going to be invested in that, in that IDO. It's going to be 100% lottery and you're not going to have an acquired allocation amount to be invested in that IDO. However, if you increase and you go further those 50,000 toots, you're going to be now considered a super tutelian as you might know already. And there's so you're going to have a little bit of advantages in your allocation. The allocation is the distribution of tokens you're going to have. So in other words, the investment, the amount of investment that is going to be accepted from your side to be uh, to be used to buy the IDO tokens. So if you're super to 10, you're going to have a 50% guaranteed allocation and 50% lottery. And if you're of the top X wallets, which means, let's say, the top 10 wallets of the Super Tutelians, the one that have the most, you're going to be 100% guaranteed. That is incredibly cool because you're going to know for sure that if you put in your um, in your pre-fund uh, $100, you know for sure that those $100 are going to be uh, used to buy the tokens of the IDO. There's also three factions that you might choose at the beginning. You need to choose whether if you are an altcoiner, Nakamoto of Buterin, but I 
t uh, I want to say that there's gonna be for sure new how to's videos okay tutorial videos that I'm gonna be filming myself when this is all launched and when this is all ready so here we're just looking at the white paper and of course we have to talk about that but do not worry about that because there's gonna be a completely tutorial of how to invest in the ideos and how to take advantage of these opportunities because they are just mainly massive opportunities of our venture section in Tutelos. We'll see us in the next video, the last one, where we're going to be looking at a little bit the appendix and all the other product services that you have to know before getting right into the practice and going straight to the decentralized app Tutelos.io. See you in the next video. Ciao!